Oh, hi, hello and welcome. If you are new, my name is Louise Pentland and I make videos about motherhood and lifestyle. If you are an oldie but goldie, come on in and get comfortable. Today I am doing a makeup video. So as some of you know, I have been working with Benefit to talk to you about their amazing Goof Proof Brow Pencil, which I wear every day. You've seen it in so many different things on Instagram and in videos. I talk about it a lot because basically it's my little saviour. It's so easy to use. And even when I'm going uh, to a work thing where they say, we've got a makeup artist, just turn it with a bare face. I always just put my brows on because I think having your brows on, for me anyway, makes you feel put together and like you can face the day. Um, so I really like this a lot. I've been using this for many years, even before I started working with Benefit. And I thought today I would show you a really easy Christmassy look. Now I'm not talking your uh, like mega glam going out look, although you could wear this, I think. I'm talking like me, for example, it's Darcy's school play this week and I will have been dashing about all day. I will have been doing some work, but I might want to kind of do myself up a little bit before I get there. So this is the kind of thing I would do for that, or perhaps if I was having lunch with some friends to catch up for Christmas, this is definitely something I would go for. So I thought I would show you that, and along the way, um, we're having a bit of a Christmassy chat because I answered Katie Ellison's Christmas tag questions that she did over on her channel last week. So I hope you enjoy this very informal, relaxed video. I hope you enjoy the effort I've made here. Look, it's mistletoe. I don't usually have Christmas decor up here, but I was like, I need something Christmassy in this video. So a bit of mistletoe. Perhaps I'll leave that hanging somewhere and have a little red lipstick kiss. Okay, before I carry on waffling on, please enjoy the rest of the video. Oh, hi. Don't worry. Don't adjust your screens. It's not an egg with hair. It is me, Louise, and I'm going to show you how I get my kind of festive Christmassy makeup look each day. I have already done my um, base. I have uh, cleansed and moisturised. I've used a bit of foundation. I use the Benefit Boying Cakeless uh, Concealer, which I really love. I just do a bit under the eyes and a little bit here because I'm always very rosy cheeked and just blend that in. And I've also done um, a little bit of foundation as well. And now I'm going to get to my brows. Now, if you have followed a while, you will know that I absolutely love the Benefit Goof Proof Brow Pencil. I usually go for a shade number two, but today I'm going to go for a three because um, I'm going a bit bolder on some of the other areas of my makeup. I'm doing a bolder lip, so I thought just for a bit of balance, I'll go slightly darker. It's not a huge difference, but I feel like it makes the look feel a bit better. It's got the little spoolie end that you just saw that I use just to brush my eyebrow hairs into place because when I wake up it's like they've been having a disco all over my face and they're all over the shop pointing in different directions. So I just brush them, brush them across and then, I mean, that was pretty simple, wasn't it? I just draw it on in like tiny little strokes as if you're just drawing little eyebrow hairs Look at the, wow, <laughs> that looks very severe on camera. Don't worry, once we've got the rest done, it'll look great. It's always the way that one is really easy and then you go to do the other side of your face on anything, whether it's like brows or liner or whatever. Like this one, I was like, yeah, wow, I'm like a brow goddess. And then this one, come on. If they look a bit too severe, I get the spoolie back out and just run it through a little bit and I find that it just takes the edge off, just softens them out just a tiny bit. Right, let's do the rest and balance this out. I'm just going to do a little bit of liquid eyeliner now. I thought whilst I was doing this, it might be fun to have a bit of a Christmassy chat. I saw that Katie Ellison did the uh, Christmas tag, so I have got some of her questions up, and I thought whilst we're chatting makeup, I would do a little bit of, um, a festive tag with you and her first question is what is your favorite Christmas movie and I have to say my favorite Christmas movie is love actually but I watch it in like September because I get so excited for Christmas that by September I'm ready for it and then I watch it and then I'm like oh I've already seen it I also really like Arthur Christmas um, and I also really like the Gavin and Stacey Christmas special which I know isn't a movie but I'm having it Right, for eyeshadow, I'm just going for a sparkly gold because it's Christmas. And if you can't have a sprinkle of glitter at Christmas, when can you? And the next Christmas question is, um, where are you spending Christmas this year? 
just FYI, I'm putting this just all over the lid because that's about the sum of my artistic skills here. Um, and we are having Christmas at home and we're actually doing Christmas lunch for 20. Um, it just got bigger and bigger and bigger and escalated and I didn't feel like I could leave anyone out. So now we're doing Christmas dinner for 20. Um, if you'd like to come, why not? <laughs> Once you've got 20, why not have thousands? <laughs> to give this a tiny bit of definition, I'm just going in with a fluffy brush and like a bit of brown and I'm just going to go do a little bit of brown in the crease there. And the next Christmas question is, what is your least favourite Christmas food? I'm going to say something shocking to you all now and I don't want you to be upset and I don't want you to come for me. It's mince pies. I don't really like mince pies. Every year I have a mince pie thinking this is going to be the year that I'm going to really, really like this. And every year I just feel like I've got like dodgy, lumpy stuff in my mouth. I don't like it. Mince pies, not for me. Um, although I am going to make mince pies with the children tomorrow uh, because it just feels so Christmassy, doesn't it? What's on your Christmas wish list? I'm just gonna highlight under the brow bone there with just a bit of highlighter. Um, and on my Christmas wish list this year, really, it's just to have a peaceful Christmas. Um, and I've said jokingly, but also not that jokingly to Liam, that I would like to spend Boxing Day on my own. He's gonna go and see some of his family and I would really like to just sit calmly without the children, uh, just watching TV, all the stuff that I didn't see on Christmas Day because I'm hosting, maybe with a glass of something nice in my hand. That's what's on my Christmas wish list this year. What is the first thing you do on Christmas Day? The first thing we do is the children wake up. They'll be awake from about six and we open their presents in bed with us. Um, and that usually takes about half an hour to an hour. And then we have showers and go downstairs and have some breakfast. Excuse Orbit in the background there, he wanted to get involved. Do you wear your best dress on Christmas day or do you go comfy? Now, I like to dress up on Christmas day. We always have people over. Um, I love dressing up anyway. I love like the glitz and glamour. I mean, look, I'm wearing statement earrings with a woolly jumper for goodness sake. I'm a dressy uppy kind of person. Uh, but no judgment to anybody that wants to stay in their PJs all day. Bit of highlight now. Do you like Brussels sprouts? Yes, I do. I didn't used to. And when I was little, I used to eat them all off my plate first. Because I'd be like, right, eat those. And then I could enjoy my Christmas dinner. Uh, but as I've gotten older, we've started doing more things with them. Hang on, I'm going to put a little bit there on my cupid's bow. Mm, uh, like putting bacon bits in and all sorts of stuff and we've really jazzed up the brussels now so i feel like brussels brussels have done well for themselves and i like them a lot now okay bit of mascara and the question is do you set a budget for christmas presents and that is a yes i do i kind of have in my mind like how much i'll spend on each person so it might be like right i'm going to spend 20 pounds on that person i'm going to spend 30 pounds on that person etc um, I do spend a little bit more on Liam and the girls, um, but I don't tend to go too overboard, really. The next question is, what is your favourite Christmas song? Um, I like that Wham one. Is it Wham? That's like, last Christmas, I gave you my heart. Uh, I think I like that one. I don't know, I like them all. Oh, I tell you what's my absolute favorite Christmas song. Silent Night by Michael Buble, and there's a little bit in it where the children sing. That just gets me. Every year when I go to Darcy's carol service, I cry because children singing Christmas songs, no, I'm gone, it's too much, it's just too perfect. Um, I'm moving on to my lips now, as you can see. This is kind of the thing that makes this look Christmassy. Excuse me, I have had a message. I think red lipstick is the epitome of a Christmas look. And even if you've got a mum bun and a jumper on, some jazzy earrings and, you know, a strong brow and some red lips and you are set to go. So I'm going to do a red lip. I think the secret to success is lip liner. Uh, and probably best not to talk whilst I'm lip lining. There we go. That's my best attempt at lip liner. What I'm gonna do for the lipstick is I'm going to use a lipstick brush. I don't normally use a lipstick brush. Usually I would just like go for it, but I want this to look really, really precise. Oh, I'm not sure about this color, it's a bit orangey. Uh-oh, my light is going. 
my little light um, is dying there. So we'll do what we can and get to the end of the video. Right, let's just go up to the edges here. Here she is. Oh, I really like that a lot. I feel a bit swish, everybody. So there you have it, that's my look for the day. I hope that you enjoyed this. I will leave those Christmas questions below for you as well as links to my brow pencil. You need it in your life. I'm sorry about that light. Thank goodness we've still got light coming in from outside. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video as much as I did making it. I think I'm gonna make some more like little chatty videos whilst I'm doing my makeup because it's quite a nice day way to start the day. I will see you very soon. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.